Hi everyone, my name is Anna and in this video I will share with you the project that I did during my internship in a company called Actinium. Actinium has different business units that focus on the industrial processes. I did my internship in the business unit called MTL that works with factories and uses a web-based manufacturing execution system called Shopware Online as their main solution. Shopware Online is a software platform that collects factory data and displays it in a dashboard. The displayed data helps the factory operators to quickly identify if the production is efficient or not and to determine where the losses are coming from. My assignment was to create a custom dashboard in Shopware Online that would visualize the data of a manufacturing process for producing sleeping matrices. So now it's time for a short demo of the dashboard created in Shopware Online. The first dashboard that is now shown on the screen gives an overview of all production lines that are in the system. As an example of the custom dashboard, I will be using one of the foaming production lines that makes foam blocks. The main purpose of this dashboard is to allow the operator to control the manufacturing process by using the production tasks and to indicate if the productivity of the manufacturing is efficient or not. The overall equipment effectiveness panel that consists of three factors is the most effective indicator of the manufacturing productivity. Availability factor shows whether the factory machine is operating or not. Let's assume that the machine had to be cleaned, therefore it was stopped for 5 minutes. To register a machine stop, an operator has to perform a production task for adding a machine stop. So let's say that our machine stop happened at 8.39 and it was restarted at 8.44 and we will specify that the stop reason is cleaning. By adding the machine stop, the availability percentage and several panels of the dashboard got affected. The machine stop that was just added is now shown in the event suite panel that displays all the events that occur during the production. It is also shown in the downtime timeline and most importantly, the availability rate percentage has dropped. Performance rate determines if the machine is producing as much products as it's supposed to, and the quality factor demonstrates how many products have met the specification. The OEE value is calculated by multiplying all those three factors together. Based on the very low value of OE that is displayed in the dashboard, the operator can determine that the manufacturing productivity is not good enough and the most losses are coming from the factory performance, which means that the factory is not producing enough materials as it should. The dashboard also provides information about the quantity of products that was produced, the time the employees spent working on the order and which workers were assigned to the production line. The downtime task gives the downtime overview of all the machine stops that occurred during the currently running shift. Based on this information, the operator can see which reasons cause the machine not to operate. Most of the time, the plant operations like traceability, quality and energy checks, OE and many more require individual applications, which makes it complicated to have the overview of the whole manufacturing operation management. The reason why MES solutions are becoming more in demand is because they combine all the plant operations into one application that enables the operators to set up very precise indicators to closely track the production. For more information, please send your questions to one of the emails that you can see on the screen. That was all. I hope that you learned something new for yourself and thank you very much for watching.